Hey guys, it's Rosie. Welcome back. Today I'm going to be um, using a whole bunch of Walmart makeup and just generally inexpensive makeup and trying to do a makeup look. I haven't really done all too much makeup, but I really want to learn. So that's one of my goals for this year is to learn how to semi do some okay makeup. Um, but I got a bunch of things and also I have other things that I've been using for a while that are just still, I'm pretty sure most of them are from Walmart, maybe some from Target, but they are all accessible and um, inexpensive. So I'm going to do a haul first and then let's get into a makeup look. So the first thing I got is this seven piece studio brush kit. So it has um, powder, blush, crease, shader, brow, smudge, and liner. I like that they're all labeled too because I don't really know that much about makeup so I know exactly which one I need to use for what I'm doing. Um, and yeah, they were, I don't know how much they were. They were cheap. The next thing is this uh, Wet n Wild contouring palette. It's got um, just like a, oh, it's in the shade Dolce de Leche. Um, and I don't know, it's just a general contour palette. But I also got a shimmery highlighter powder because I like this one better than the highlight on the contouring palette so I'll use both of them but this one will be the super highlight and this is in the shade Precious Petals. Um, and then the last thing that I bought this time I was there is this palette. It's called Festival from Profusion Cosmetics. I love all the colors on it. I'm really excited to use this and it was like $13 I think so I'm pretty sure that's really good for a palette. Um, so, I don't exactly know what I'm going to do. I want to use glitter somehow, but I think I might stick to more gentle nude tones. So, I guess I'm going to um, get started with the base. I will be using foundation today. I don't normally use foundation, but I um, thought I'd do it for a change. So, I don't really know how I'm going to set up my mirror so I can see it. But I will be right back when I get a little setup going and then I will do my foundation and concealer and everything. Um, actually, I'm going to go through the other products that I'm using. I'm also using the L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable Concealer um, in the shade Fair Light. And CoverGirl Clump Crusher Mascara. It's brown mascara. And... L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable um, Foundation in the shade Nude Beige. So, I'll be right back when I set up my mirror, and then we'll get into the makeup. I'm back, and I decided to move. I think this is a better setup. My mirror is just right here. So, I will not be looking off into any weird direction, except right here. So, I'm going to get started with this foundation. Um, I'm not... I'm not very good at makeup, so just keep that in mind when you're watching me put stuff on with my fingers and then blend it out, just... I'm sorry. Okay, I can't really tell if that's good. I think it, it looks good enough. Now I'm going to move on to concealer because I have a few spots and then I'm going to do around my eyes because I kind of have like translucent eyelids. It's kind of weird. But concealer and then I will move on to eyeshadow, I guess. It'll be scary, but I can do it. I'm gonna comb out my brows and then I don't have any brow gel so I'm not gonna do that. I guess I guess it's time to open up my new palette and I need to open up my brushes. I'm going to take my shader brush, obviously labeled shader, and 
trying to decide if I want to do something colorful or not. I'm thinking I will mess it up very, very terribly if I do colorful. So I'm thinking like an orangey brown. So I'm taking the shade Campground. Um, and I'm just going to put it there. <laughs> I'm gonna go in with a little bit of orange. We'll see. Um, I'm gonna use Beat. I'm gonna take a little bit of Winning and Strobe Lights. To lighten up the inner corner even more. <sighs> okay, I think it looks okay, but I'm going to stop with the eyeshadow before I mess it up because I, I'd rather have okay than good and then bad. So now I'm going to move on to mascara. And then I'll do contour. No, I'll do contour first. See, this is another thing that I've never done. I've never contoured. So, bear with me as I try to not completely do a terrible job. I do already have some shimmery lip gloss on, so I'm not going to do anything with my lips, but I think I need to do my hair and take some pictures. I'm really not sure how this turned out. I can't really see it very well in this setup. It looks fine in my mirror. It looks fine in the viewfinder. So I don't know what it's going to look like when I get um, my hair done and everything. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Um, hopefully this turned out okay. Let me know what you guys think um, and what else you want to see um, for makeup videos if you want to see more. Um, make sure you follow me on all social media at Rosie Revolts and you can see the results there. Um, also check out my book at getoutdoorsbook.com. Check out my Etsy shop um, Rosie Revolts to buy some of my custom necklaces and I will see you guys later. Bye! Update, I added a little blue on underneath, um, on, like, my waterline, and I think it looks a lot better. So, yeah, I'll show you pictures because the lighting here is not good because I turned off my light. But, yeah, thanks again for watching. Um, bye! <laughs>